Pruning your shrubs and trees is an important part of gardening and it's done for a few reasons. To improve the shape, reduce the size and remove any dead, damaged or diseased branches. Small stems and branches up to the size of your little finger are best done with small pruners, but for those larger and thicker, loppers and saws are the way to go. I've just got a dead branch on the bay tree here, so I'm going to get it with the loppers, and the beauty of these is, because they've got long handles, I get that extra reach without having to use a ladder. And I'm just above the other branch, and then cut through. These Dalac bypass loppers are perfect for the job. Carefully constructed for strength, durability and comfort. Oval shaped aluminium handles, carbon steel blades, cushioned buffers to prevent jarring and rubber grips. Beautiful. For extra power but less effort, ratchet loppers are sensational. It's like having gears on your loppers. Open and place around the branch, close to the first click, open, close and repeat for serious purchase up to 50 millimetres thick. Being telescopic is a huge advantage with these. You just push the buttons in, release the locks, and then you can slide down the handle and prune just over a metre away. An absolute must in any gardener's pruning arsenal is a folding saw. They're just so handy and compact, they'll fit in your pocket. Now, they open up and lock to reveal the unique sabre tooth pattern here, and they'll make light work of dead or alive, wet or dry wood without clogging. It cuts on the pull stroke as opposed to carpentry saws that cut on the push stroke. You see? Pocket chainsaws are remarkable tools. You've got the chain here with two handles, and you just pull back and forth steadily until you're through the branch. The genius in these pocket chainsaws is in the simplicity. And if you want to do higher branches, then you attach the ropes, one at each end. And this side here is weighted. You throw that up over the branch, and then the true guide here will sit the chain automatically into position. And then you just pull on each side with the ropes until you're through the branch. It's beautiful stuff. And when you're done, it all just packs away into this little pouch here. Now, if you want to get your hands on these great Dalak tools, just go to the Mr. Fothergill's website. <laughs>